What up, everyone? Welcome to another episode of Reddy's Talks, the show that we talk about everything and anything. And before we get to this episode's topic, I just want to remind you guys that if you guys like this episode, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, and hit that little bell icon down below. That way, you guys are notified about my future videos. And that way, you don't have to check my channel out in order to get to a whole root hassle of finding new videos. I mean, honestly, it's great that you guys check the channel out though don't get me wrong that way you guys got to see music videos and chug reviews and stuff i've done in the past and you know new fans got to see all my old stuff it, if you want to do that that is fine but 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 you know saving yourself the inconvenience hit the bell icon that way you know crush the algorithm and help me out and help yourself out as well that's if you do like the episode anyways let's get to the topic and that is cm punk baby cm punk cm punk CM Punk. Well, you hate to say this, but he got into a backstage altercation with Jack Perry. And we're not talking about a written segment either. I'm sorry, AEW can't come up with a good good segment like that. Ooh. <laughs> I'm joking. Joking. Anybody who's an AEW fan, I'm joking. No, but see, AEW does have, like, you know, problems with writing a bit. And definitely a problem with the women's division. I'm sorry. Um, you know, T, I think TNA has better women's division storylines than fucking AEW does. Uh, they need to work on that, though. But anyways, uh, yeah, an altercation happened, and uh, I'm reading it right here. I haven't seen All In yet. I'm, I'm planning to watch it. I, I wanted to do the episodes for you guys so you guys can actually watch, uh, you know, my uh, my podcast. Uh, but I just want to show you guys this right now. According to Metro.co.uk, uh, this was an apparent re reference uh, to reports the pair had a backstage row. I'm guessing a row means incident. UK fans, please teach me, you know, what Roe is. But earlier, this uh, is when Perry, the son of the late Riverdale actor Luke Perry, or 90210 actor, let's put that in mind, uh, wanted to use real glass in a segment on AEW Collision. Punk is said to have taken issue with that and intervened with the plans being scrapped on safety concerns, which apparently angered Perry. On Sunday, it was reported by Fightful Select that he confronted Punk backstage just minutes before, you know, Punk's match uh, was, you know, to take on Joe, Samoa Joe, that is, in the first match of the main card. According to PW Insider, the altercation began with both men shoving each other before Punk caught Perry in a choke. I guess a choke hold, that's what they meant. Uh, it said Perry was told to leave Wembley Stadium and was not in attendance for the rest of the show while Punk remained backstage, although he hasn't, or say wasn't featured on screen once this match was over. Well, for Punk not being on screen, I guess that's because of the whole, they don't want the whole brawl out to happen again. Uh, with CM Punk eating muffins and drinking seltzer at the post show and I guess talking about Jack Perry and getting Perry pissed off. You know, Perry's not there. I'm pretty sure Perry would be pissed off because if he could hold a grudge like this about the glass and wait, because I think the glass incident what happened like two weeks ago, I believe. Um, and he, you know, got into CM Punk's face about it right now. I guess, you know, he could hold a grudge. And honestly, this is Jack Perry's fault, um, you know, about everything because honestly i think with the whole glass situation when it was reported uh, a lot of people were kind of skeptic about that and they were like oh you know we can't believe jack perry could act like that but i heard that uh you know because I, I didn't want to show because they did they, they, for those people who, did, well, who probably watched this and they haven't seen all in yet they do ruin um a match so i didn't want to show that uh, part of this reporting but i will say that uh it, they did mention that during uh, Jack Perry's match with Hook, that he looked into the camera and said, real glass, cry me a river. So, yeah, I, that report about the glass situation with Jack Perry uh, and CM Punk, it's real. So, bravo to AEW for uh, removing Jack Perry and keeping CM Punk off the air. Because CM Punk, you know, he likes to spit it out and say it is what it is. So Jack Perry is definitely in the wrong on this. Um, what will happen? Well, honestly, the way the way uh, way AEW is, I think Jack Perry is going to go to uh, Dynamite because he's going to be with the Elite. 
because uh, they're doing this whole thing where the elite doesn't want to be bothered with CM Punk and they're keeping them separate. So CM Punk it has collision and the elite have dynamite. So we'll have to wait and see. But I, I think, you know, honestly, I, I, I think there should be more than that. You know, Tony Khan has to show some balls, show some guts. Like he's a fucking owner of a company for Christ's sakes. Like, you know, fines have got to happen. You know, fine fucking Jack Perry. Suspend him, you know. Show him that he can't fucking do this shit. Like, he can't get away with, like, you know, starting fights and shit, you know. CM Punk should be reprimanded, too, you know, but not as much as with Jack Perry because CM Punk, he was just defending himself in a way. But then again, I don't know, if Jack Perry showed him and CM Punk showed him back and then Jack Perry showed him and then CM Punk put him in the chokehold, that's another story. Like, we don't know how it happened. We don't know if Jack Perry punched him and then, you know, CM Punk like put him in a chokehold and whatnot. We just we just heard shove, 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 then chokehold. So we don't know how that whole thing played out. But either way, fine suspensions. You know, I know they're not going to suspend suspend uh, CM Punk, so just fine him because you know, honestly, I think CM Punk thinks he's like invincible right now because uh, Discovery um, has given him like a, his own platform. You know, Collision, and they they you know they. They think that CM Punk is a moneymaker. Um, don't get me wrong. You know, he could be a moneymaker. But the thing is, is that, you know, I want to see the proof of the pudding. I would like to see the elite on Collision and CM Punk on Dynamite and to see the ratings. Because if the ratings are like the same thing as Collision, if CM Punk was on Dynamite, then CM Punk is not a fucking draw at all. And his magic died. You know, his flame died. But if he does bring in the ratings, then that's great. Um, so what's going to happen? Like I said, you know, Jack Perry, I think he's going to go to dynamite. You know, I don't think Tony Khan is going to have the balls to fucking find them both and suspend Jack Perry. Cause Jack Perry should be suspended, you know, for starting this whole bullshit. Uh, but I, Tony Khan likes to award people and not punish people. So that's what it comes down to. And, uh, that's it. You know, I see Jack Perry being moved to dynamite. CM Punk stays on collision. And, you know, even though the investigation's there, this thing's probably going to get swept up. Uh, and that's about it. I don't know. I could be wrong. I could be wrong. I could be wrong. I, I, you know, Jack Perry could be suspended uh, and, and whatnot. But I just, I don't know. I, I don't see it happening because AEW, it's, you know, the inmates are running the asylum. Anyways, what do you guys think? CM Punk versus Jack Perry backstage. Um, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, uh, let me guys know what you guys think in the comments down below. Uh, every time I say this, uh, you know it's the end, and that is for the past, the present, and for the future. Thank you guys for tuning in. Uh, hopefully, you guys like AEW all in. I hope I do. And. Um, I don't know, man. I might make a video about it. Uh, anyways, keep it brutal. Stay tuned. Be safe.